100 rated chess, but your pieces are lazy, they will refuse to move unless they are in direct view of their king. I think I've done something a bit similar to this before, but since I don't remember it, plus the fact that there is no way that video was a success, it is time for a retry. We get a 125 from Saudi Arabia. E4. I mean I had to move one of the three pawns, so there was nothing much to think about. G6. Not very aggressive. Okay. Here we go. Bishop c4. The plan is simple. Bishop c4, queen f3 threatening mate, he blunders checkmate, king e2 because I cannot move my queen to checkmate when the king doesn't see her, he blunders checkmate for the second time in a row, queen f7 mission accomplished. Ha! Exactly as planned. Queen f3. Okay now d5 will absolutely destroy this video because it will stop the checkmate and win my bishop at the same time as I cannot retreat it outside of the king's vision, but since that move is just blundering a pawn, there is no way he's playing it. Right? Alright. Change of plan. King f1. The bishop is dead, so the new plan is knight h3 knight g5 also going for the f7 pawn. Rest in peace Frank. Knight h3. I mean you guys may say that I should have played g4 before knight h3 to avoid it being taken immediately by the bishop, but since he already made it clear that he wants to fianchetto his bishop, he's not just gonna take it right now. Right? Absolutely. g3. The king needs to give the order to his horsey, and in no world do you take this pawn right now and then win my queen next move just because I cannot move her due to the rules. No world, including this one. Yeah, no doubt. King g2. One down, two to go. f5. Aha, he's obviously preparing to go bishop takes e4 skewering my royal couple, and since I don't really want to waste a move moving my queen, knight g5. I mean if he still insists on skewering me, my knight actually cannot take back due to the rules, but he doesn't know about that, and there is a bigger chance that he will just take this pawn with his pawn, queen f7 will become possible, so I believe that this is a worthy risk. Very convenient. Queen f7 check. And I've just realized, that now none of these pieces can move because the king doesn't see them anymore. Wow. Now what? I mean I can consider getting my rook in, but queen e8 is just winning my queen for free, and there is no way my rook can make any progress before that happens. Aha! I think I've got an amazing idea. Fuck the challenge, queen e6 king e8 queen f7 king d7 queen e8 king e8 queen f7 king d7 draw by repetition. And since I ended the video myself, there is no what the f*** today.